Hello guys and welcome to part one of the find any triangle program. In this part I'm going to be going over the first program so let's get started. Uh, in the description is the code. Uh, I'm just going to be scrolling through it in this video so I'm not actually going to be typing it out because it would take me way too long. So first thing you need to do is you need to start a new program and name it F-I-N-D-S-T-U-F find stuff spelled without the second F okay so go ahead and do that and then once you've done that if you don't already have my clear and unclear programs in your calculator you're going to need to go to a video because it's uh, we need that one for this program so uh, annotated in the description go to that video get the clear unclear programs it'll take two seconds and then come back alright now that you're done with that alright we're gonna get started uh, right here this is just taking the inputs and turning it and storing it as a variable so they put A and B and it's storing it as C uh, then this is one side of the triangle that is drawn here's another side of the triangle that is drawn uh, this is displaying uh, the three uh, sides of the triangle and these three texts here, here and here are for the uh, for the angles in the triangles and all these programs are super super similar uh, so you're going to be seeing this a lot so you'll have to get all this from the description I'm going to keep going. So that's the last leg, uh, or the last side of the triangle drawn out. See, it says line. And then pause so that uh, the screen waits for you to hit enter. And then it returns back to the main program. So that's pretty much it. Uh, the rest of these programs are going to be pretty much identical to that. And uh, I'll see you next time. If you have any questions, put a comment. Uh, or write a comment. That's it. Thanks.